Hey guys, I'm Dutin here. Hold on. Hey guys, I'm Dutin here. The uh, topic of this video is river tracing. It's something that I've I just heard about a few years back. I think it's it's a fairly it's not a new sport, but it's it's a fairly it's it's just recently gained gaining popularity. You know, because I, I never heard about it before, and then all of a sudden, recently, I'm hearing more and more about it. And I, I tried to search for it on, on a dictionary, and it, it, like the term, like a, a dictionary that has terms and, and sayings as well as just words, and it couldn't find the term river tracing. It didn't exist, so it's still not as as popular as other uh, sports. Um, what it is is it's just like uh, hiking. Except you do it in a river. You find a river that's uh, shallow, and you just walk in the river, up the river, and you know, like you, you try to trace it to its source or whatever. So it's called river tracing, and you, it's 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 uh, it's fun because it's it's like hiking except you're in water, so you, it helps keep you cool. And uh, you know, anytime you start sweating or whatever from the hike, you can just dive into the water at, at parts where it's you know maybe you got a few feet of water. You can just sit down, lie down in the water cool off, keep continue on high. It's just, yeah. It's, it's a really cool concept. I haven't done it yet. I've, I went, to, I met a guy who like ran a river tracing tour thing and uh, I lost his card. And then a, a friend of mine contacted me and he wants to, he wants, he, he's, he's going river tracing today and he invited me. Uh, he invited me a little bit too forcefully though, because he, he said like, you want to come out on Monday? He's, he, well, he wrote, like, what did he write? He's like, yeah, we're going to do it either Monday or Wednesday, whichever is better for you, but we'd prefer Monday. So it's like, whichever is better for you, but we'd prefer Monday. So I'd be an asshole at this point if I said Wednesday, but Monday is actually really bad for me. But I was like, oh, wh whichever has the better weather. So he says, okay, we're doing it Monday. And then I'm like, I thought about it, and like, Monday really is bad for me. So I'm like, yeah, no, Monday's no good for me. And then he's like, what the fuck, man? We planned this just for you. We picked the date just for you, you know? This is, we, 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 we organized everything around your schedule. Do you even know my schedule? What the fuck? And he's like, oh, well, it doesn't matter anyways because we, we changed this to Wednesday because of the weather. And I'm like, uh, you know, and then it, 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 it raised a lot of uh, red flags. It's like, okay, what's going on here? So I'm like, but, but you know, I, I want to do it. I like river tracing is something that I'm interested in and I wanted to do and he's doing it. Like, and this is the river that we're doing, I'm guessing. They just like hike up this river and you can see there's a guy standing in it fishing. Imagine how much fun it would be just to walk all the way up this for like a few, a few for miles, you know? It's just, it's just, it's gorgeous. And then, and then what you do is you can like, when you get far enough up, you can just like go up to a bus stop or something and catch the bus back to your vehicles. Like you find somewhere safe to park, like maybe over here in front of these things, park your motorcycle here. Walk over here, jump over the roof, break your legs, wait for the ambulance. And then um, once you finish hiking, you just catch a bus back. There's buses that run this road, and then back to your vehicles. So, anyways, yeah. And then, uh, so I decided, yeah, okay, I'll do it. But then something came up, which is pretty normal for me. I'm, I'm busy. Uh, yesterday, my water broke, <laughs> and I'm having a baby. No, my wa my plumbing broke at my, ho my house and I, got, I had like a pipe that was spraying water but luckily it wasn't in my house it was up on my roof so my roof was just pouring water down a plumber came he fixed it he fixed some other things too and then he left and then this morning I realized we, our house doesn't have water like so he, he fixed some things but then something else broke in the process so I phoned him up this morning he says he'll come back today my wife's not gonna be home today our house needs water, so I, I had to cancel. But I know he's gonna, he, if he flipped out about me canceling the first time, he's gonna flip out even more about me canceling the second time. So I thought, well, I got a little bit of time in the morning, not enough to do river tracing, but enough to go and uh, to go and cancel. So I'm gonna show up and say on my motorcycle and be like, yeah, I can't make it. And then I'm gonna leave. <laughs> but I'm, I'm thinking that's better than like doing it in a text message. But I, you know, I got a valid excuse. But yeah, but nonetheless, I was, I'm was i still a little uneasy going today because it was like, you know, this is all for you. You have to come. And meanwhile, he's with a bunch of strangers, guys that I've never met before. So why the fuck would a bunch of strangers change their schedules for some guy they've never met before? Unless maybe they know I'm M13 and they're curious to like, you know, get a glimpse at me. And 
no offense to them, but I, I don't want, I'm, you know, I'm, I don't like being a freak show. You know, I'm not, so, you know, maybe, you know, maybe they've never heard of me and maybe I'm overthinking it. But even, even like my wife, she's like, yeah, why would he say that he, everyone who doesn't even know you change their schedules to accommodate you? That doesn't make sense, really. If he had just been like, yeah, we're going to go river tracing on uh, a Monday and you can come or not come, here's the address. I would have been like, 100%, yeah, I'm doing it. You know, I would have, I would have, I would have found a way. Even though Monday was was busy for me, I would have, I would have, uh, I would have shown up. Because there's like no pressure. You know, I don't like someone putting pressure on me. Yeah, you know, <laughs> hey man, you want to do this with me? And you can't say no because we've already fucking changed everything just for you. What the fuck? I didn't even know about this until you're mentioning it just now to me. And now you're telling me I have to go, otherwise you're gonna be pissed? What the fuck? You know? <laughs> so, yeah. So I'm gonna go meet a bunch of foreigners. And uh, if I show up and they're, and they're, if I show up and they're all like just giving me dirty looks, I'm just gonna be like, okay, hello, goodbye, and then leave. <laughs> Turn right. Turn right. Ugh. Well, we're there now, so. You guys look for me. You guys can make the video full screen and, and pause it and check all their expressions. I can't do that. <laughs> and then if some of them are giving me dirty looks, type it in really quickly. And that way I'll know. Really fucking. Uh, that's them. Oh, they're all smiling. Hey. Hey. I, I can't make it. <laughs> no, I can't. I didn't bring any. I uh, my plumbing is shot, and the plumber came yesterday and he was fixing it, and then when he left, and then this morning I checked it, and the water's not working. So I had to call him, and he's coming back today. Okay. And my wife's not home, but I can hang out for a little bit. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. How long? Yeah, well, I'll just go with you guys to the river thing, see where you guys do it. We're actually going to go into the water. Yeah, I know. I will, I'll just go with you to that point and check it out like where it is. Right away, though. Like, if we jump in, we... Yeah, I know. Okay, okay. okay. So. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I, I got to be back home by 11.30, so I can't do it. Okay. Sorry, guys. Right. Nice to meet you, though. I'm David. David. Nice to meet you, man. What's your name? Hey, how you doing? Uh, just call me M. M. It's my nickname. Kel. Kel? Yoen, David, Kel. Cool names, like Superman, kind of. the ninja. Well, I'm just coming for a, a quick sprint, so. Yeah, yeah, okay. How long was the drive? Like, uh, how many kilometers? I was a horrible, it was a horrible drive because I, I followed the fucking GPS instead of my common sense, and it took me through non-stop towns and cities, even though I know a mountain road that goes all the way here. <laughs> I thought the GPS might do something different, unique, and it was just fucking traffic light after traffic light. But yeah, it's about, a, it's only, it's not that far. It's 40, 40 minutes from my house, maybe. Okay, not bad, not bad. All right, yeah, the river's just ahead, right after the bridge, so let's uh, keep going. So how'd you meet these guys? From, from his, his, his I website? I met him through a friend of this girl that I was seeing. And I met him at a crowd surfing event, and he's his friend. My classmate from yeah. the university. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. And this is a tour guide that I was talking about that I went on a, a tour with. For 10 days all over Taiwan. He's Canadian. Uh, where about the county are you from, by the way? Uh, Winnipeg. Oh, gotcha, okay. Winnipeg, capital, wait, Saskatchewan, is there? <laughs> Manitoba. We're next to Saskatchewan. Manitoba and Saskatchewan, they're the two prairie provinces. And Manitoba is right next to it. Oh, yeah, you've been here, yeah. Yeah, 15 years. You're in university, so you guys are studying Chinese? That's right, yep. Yeah. Cool. I can't read or write it at all, so I'm envious of that. Hmm. I like your bike, dude. I have not seen the ninja. It looks quite nice. Ah, uh, it's a little dirty. I like it. I'm happy with it. People keep telling me to change my bike because I've had this thing for like seven, eight years. Why, why it? Yeah. I've upgraded it too much. I keep spending money on it. Yeah. 
So you guys don't have classes in the you don't have classes in the weekdays? Oh, uh, I have classes today. I, I skipped them. Huh. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get on a plane, go back to America tomorrow morning. Whoa. Tomorrow afternoon at one o'clock. Just for a visit or for good? Uh, for good. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the next day to start grad school. Have you been on this trail or area before? Not this specific road. I've been down the, the main road, then right before we turned off to come down here. Okay. That main road I've been on a few times recently. Oh, yeah, we were here last week. Oh, okay. Yeah, we climbed up the river. And it was enough water. Uh, yeah, well, it's through the river. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rain and water were here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, we didn't have any water until we got here. It's not going to be here. River tracing is a fairly new fad, isn't it? Like the last few years. I've only been hearing about it for about, well, five years, but still, you know, in the grand scheme of things, that's still fairly new, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Uh, whenever I search it, I, I never find it for anywhere else in the world. Yeah, I did, I did a search in a dictionary, yeah. like a, a dictionary that has phrases as well, and it, it didn't exist. Yeah. River what? Yeah. 